Apple just revealed new details about Apple TV Plus, and we just got very excited. So you know how everyone's panicking about the upcoming streaming wars and how we will possibly be able to afford 900 different subscription services? Well, take a deep breath because things are honestly really looking up. Apple announced today that their Apple TV Plus service costs, drumroll please, $4.99 a month. That's right, for the cost of one less latte a month, we can access Apple TV Plus. Oh, and it gets better. Anyone who buys a new Apple device will receive a whole year of free Apple TV Plus. And let's face it, they just announced the new iPhone 11 today, and we know people are jumping to get their hands on it, so that's a lot of free Apple TV. Apple TV Plus, by the way, will be available online on Apple devices and on Samsung Smart TVs when they launch, and then they'll be making their way to Amazon Fire, LG, Roku, Sony, and Vizio devices as well. Well, the launch is officially slated for November 1st, which means that's also the premiere date for some of Apple's originals, most of which will be debuting with three episodes, with one new episode rolling out weekly moving forward. And apparently full seasons of some series will be available all at once, although we don't know which yet. So what can we watch on November 1st? Four of their highly anticipated shows. Haley Steinfeld is starring as Emily Dickinson in Dickinson, which Apple describes as a scripted comedy that explores the constraints of society, gender, and family from the perspective of a budding writer who doesn't fit into her own time. Here's a peek at the teaser. No thanks. The wait is almost over for the project that unites Reese Witherspoon, Jennifer Aniston, and Steve Carell. This is the show that brought Jen and Steve back to TV. If you can't tell, I'm way too excited about this one, so here's a look at the morning show. My co-host and partner of 15 years, was fired today. Yeah. Ah! What better way to launch Apple's animated series than by bringing back the entire Peanuts gang for all new adventures in their new series aptly titled Peanuts. Also at the launch, we're getting two intense dramas, C, which is set 600 years in the future and stars Jason Momoa, and For All Mankind, which is described as a space drama and is set in an alternative timeline where the space race never ended. In addition to these shows, so many A-list stars are signed on for more Apple TV projects. Just to name a few, we have Joseph Gordon-Levitt, Chris Evans, Kristen Bell, Jennifer Garner, and Julianne Moore, all with shows coming to Apple TV. All right, you guys, that's all the news I have to share with you. Are you excited about Apple's new shows? Do you think the subscription is worth it? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below, and don't forget to subscribe. When you're done with all that, be sure to click right over here for another new video. As always, I'm your host, Fiona Zaring. You can follow me on socials at Fiona Zaring, and I'll see you guys next time.